Flying Below the Radar, Mastering Stealth in Language. Hello, everyone, welcome to our channel, where we dive deep into the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're exploring a very intriguing phrase, flying below the radar. Stick around to discover its meaning, origins, and how you can use it in everyday conversation. By understanding such expressions, you'll not only enrich your vocabulary but also gain insights into the cultural nuances of the English language. The phrase, flying below the radar, originally comes from aviation technology. Radars are used to detect and locate objects, such as aircraft, by sending out waves that reflect off those objects. If an airplane flies low enough, it can avoid detection by the radar, essentially moving unnoticed. In everyday language, to fly below the radar means to go about one's business quietly, without attracting attention or causing alarm. This can be strategic, allowing someone to avoid trouble or scrutiny while achieving their goals. This expression dates back to military tactics used during World War II, where aircraft would fly at low altitudes to evade enemy detection. Over time, it was adopted into civilian vernacular to describe actions or behaviors intended to remain unnoticed or unobtrusive. Understanding the origins of phrases like these not only helps with comprehension but also provides a glimpse into the history and evolution of language. Now, let's talk about how to use this phrase effectively in your daily conversations. 1. Discussing strategy. When planning to achieve something without drawing public attention, you might say, we need to fly below the radar until we're ready to launch. 2. Personal goals. If someone is working on a personal project or goal discreetly, they could use the phrase, I'm trying to fly below the radar while I work on my novel. 3. Avoiding detection. In contexts where someone wants to avoid attention or scrutiny, he's been flying below the radar at work to avoid any conflict. Remember, the key to using idiomatic expressions like this one is understanding both the literal and figurative meanings, as well as the context in which they can be applied. Thank you for joining us today as we explored the meaning and uses of flying below the radar. We hope this video has shed light on this fascinating expression, enhancing your understanding and appreciation of the English language. Remember, Language learning is not just about memorizing words and grammar, it's also about grasping the cultural and historical contexts that give those words life. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.